Hi, this is Mr. Mulaney. I'm talking to you today about Maximilien Robespierre, a very, very important figure in the French Revolution. So Robespierre is the leader of the Jacobin faction. The Jacobins are the extreme radicals in the National Assembly. The National Assembly turns to the, the Jacobins. The Jacobins take power. They change the National Assembly to the convention. The convention is elected by more than just male taxpayers. Basically, all males can vote for members of the convention. And the convention is led by the Committee of Public Safety, led by Maximilien Robespierre. This is known as the Reign of Terror. Robespierre is a radical. He ch the Committee of Public uh, city, uh, Safety and the Jacobins change everything or as much as they can about France. They change the street names to be names that honor the revolution. They change the calendar and they execute anyone and everyone who they think is disloyal to the revolution. That's why it's called the Reign of Terror. The Reign of Terror ends when Robespierre himself is ex executed in what's called the Thermidorian Reaction. It's basically a uh, backlash against all these radical changes that the Jacobins instituted during the Reign of Terror. It's called Thermidorian because the Jacobins changed the calendar and that was the month of Thermidor. They were so radical, they changed the calendar. All right, they changed everything. So Robespierre actually tried to attempt suicide because he knew that they were going to get, get him and put him in the guillotine like he had done to all his enemies. He is unsuccessful, shoots himself in the jaw, and then in tremendous, he's, he's in agony when they uh, execute him. And that is Maximilian Robespierre.